Okay, so I have boiling in here for about half an hour now um, under medium uh, heat and I lowered it to see a four right now. Okay. So what I have boiling in here is lemongrass, ginger, um, pandan leaves, and galango. Okay, and also one of uh, my um, peppers. I'll be adding um, next, this is green tea, or they call it um, or sticky rice tea. This tea, um, we don't have it in the States here. This one came from Laos, okay? But the bag on it uh, sh uh, shows um, Chinese writing. This tea has a very nice aroma, like a rice aroma. So I can understand why they call it um, uh, sticky rice tea, even though it's uh, the leaves are uh, really green tea. Okay, so I'll be adding this in. And this, I will be boiling this for another 15 minutes. There you go. And then in the last 15 minutes, I will be adding in these um, dried flowers. And these two right here are hollyhocks. These two here are echinacea. And these are butterfly pea flowers. So I will be add these in um, in the last 15 minutes. So in total, um, I boiled the tea for one hour, okay? So again, this pot right here was boiling for, I mean, was boiled for 30 minutes and then I added the green tea for another 15 minutes and the flowers will go in at the last 15 minutes. Um, after I boil the, the tea, I'm going to turn it off, turn off the heat and I will be adding in one heaping uh, serving spoon of unpasteurized honey. Okay, so when you are ready to serve, you can add a lemon. Um, I recommend that you add about half a lemon to it, okay? So when you are sick, do not be afraid of honey if you are not diabetic. Okay, so honey and lemon. Okay, and so this is the kind of tea I use for my family and friends um, when they have COVID symptoms or when they are in recovery or I just boil it for anybody to drink as a prevention also, okay? And again, like I said before, for colds or, or the flu or even um, like for headaches or fatigue. Okay, and this is my tea for um, for my daughter because she is uh, she has COVID again.